Hello everyone, my name is Agustin Caruso and welcome to our station. In this episode, I'm going to teach you how you can create a mask with an SVG text, meaning you're going to be able to see the background through the text. The effect is going to look something like this. All right, let's get started. All right, so the best way for us to see this effect in action is by creating a text block here, which I called normal text, then increasing its size, its size so I can see its background a little bit more. So you can see it here in height, I can change it to 1.0, but I actually prefer 1.5, so we can see a little bit more of its background. And then I come here in the same text element in background, image and gradient, and I actually choose one that I already uploaded right then uh, you can you can change it here you can center it you can put it on top this is what i chose just out of curiosity this picture shows where i'm currently living in brazil which is a beautiful place <laughs> all right back to subject after taking this putting this as a background and calling this a normal text it's very important that we call it uh, something uh, that we can remember because what we're going to do next is we're going to come here into onto pages home or basically where the element is go to settings and we're going to paste this code right here, which I'm going to ha have it available for you guys down in the description of this video. And in here, what basically happens is we're taking the fill color to turn it into transfer transparent for our text, right? And in the background clip, uh, we're then we're turning it into text and we're doing this onto this ID element. But uh, as you can see right now, we're having a discrepancy, a difference here, because I am applying all of this into awesome text and I'm actually using normal text just to showcase what's the difference. So before applying the text, what would happen is uh, just, just a little thing is that you cannot uh, see this effect in action with the preview. You actually need to go to the published website, right? This, this is the normal thing that would happen, right? Nothing is applied here, but if I change here, Sorry, my normal text. If I change it here to awesome text, which was the one that I applied the code there, and I publish it, this is what's going to happen. All right. Now, this is an awesome effect. Now, another thing that we could be doing is what if we actually want uh, the text at the background to scroll while we're scrolling to the page? All right. Easy, there's an easy way to do this. We come here to awesome text. We go uh, onto backgrounds. So the same place we were before. And here, what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna choose here a fixed configuration, right? Fixed positioning. All right, once we do that, once again, we need to come here to publish. Back to the website. And now it actually scrolls with our web page. Isn't that awesome? All right, guys, I hope you found this tutorial useful. Remember that I'm going to leave the, the code in the description of this video. Also, at the end of this video, I'm going to leave a card for you to, uh, to see my playlist with other awesome Webflow tutorials. And I hope you enjoy it. I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye bye.